friends. Today we're going to be talking about author's point. So the author's point is basically what the author wants you to understand about the main topic. And then the author always gives reasons, which are going to be like facts, information, or examples, and those are going to support the author's point. So they're going to help you really understand the point that the author is trying to make. So we're going to take a look at some anchor charts, and then we are going to actually look at a short passage and see if we can identify the point that the author is making and then the reasons that the author gives to support that point. Let's take a look. So again, the author's point is what the author wants me to know or learn about the topic. It's something important that the author wants me to understand. And in order to get me to understand the author's point, the author is going to give me reasons when I'm reading. So those reasons are going to explain the idea. They're going to explain the point that the author is trying to get me to understand. Let's take a look at this passage about vegetables. First, I will read the passage to you. Then we will think together to figure out the author's point and the reasons that the author gives to support the point they are making. Vegetables. I love to eat vegetables. You should eat vegetables with every meal. Vegetables have nutrients like vitamins in them, which are good for our bodies. Eating vegetables helps keep us healthy. Vegetables are an easy and tasty way to add pretty colors to your plate. Scientists even say that eating vegetables will make you happier. If you don't eat vegetables with every meal, you should start now. Now that I've read the passage, let's try to figure out the author's point. When I was reading, the author seemed really certain that they want us to eat vegetables with every meal. I think that that is the author's point. The author wrote this passage to tell us that we should eat vegetables with each meal. That is the author's point. Now we are going to identify some reasons that the author gives to support their point that we should eat vegetables with every meal. Remember, reasons are the facts, examples, or information that support or explain the point that the author is trying to make. The author of this passage gives us many reasons to support their point. First, she says that vegetables have nutrients like vitamins in them, and she tells us that these are good for our body. Then she tells us that vegetables help keep us healthy. She also tells us that vegetables are an easy and tasty way to add pretty colors to our plates. Finally, she tells us that scientists even say that eating vegetables makes us happier. This author gave some great reasons with facts and examples to support her point that we should eat vegetables every day. Do you agree with the author? I think I do. I'm going to start eating vegetables with every meal. Thanks for learning with me today, kindergarten. I'll see you soon.